Hello ladies. Just wanted to come on and show you a couple of um good finds I found. Good finds I found. Um first at the charity shop. Uh I haven't been to our village charity shops for quite some time, but I put up my on Saturday last Saturday. And the first thing I got was these napkins. Now I've washed them and they seem to have shrunk a little bit, but um, I'm not bothered about that. But beautiful appliques on them. And then this is like a, I'd say like a, a for a tray. Uh, and that's got a lovely heart and flowers in it. Some beautiful appliques there. God knows what we use it for. But they're nice. And then these went with it. And they're like tr um, for the trays, you know, to put on your tray and that. And they're pretty. And they were just one fifty for the lot, which is a bargain at our charity shops because um, they're quite expensive now, charity shops, I find, especially for this type of thing. So I thought that was a lovely bargain. I did see these on the Saturday. And I thought, no, you've got enough cloth and everything. So I left them. But then I went back Monday and I was very lucky that they were still here because this is a lovely big runner. It's like a peachy, an off-white peachy colour embroidery on there. It's awfully long. Um, I'm not sure if you'd be able to see. If I do like that and I'll do, show you half of it so you can tell it's, uh, it's a lot of material there. That's only half, I folded it in half there to show you. So, lovely bit of lace. And uh, I like that very much. It might um, might do something in my bedroom when that gets painted the end of this month. Or, or for in here, I'm not sure yet. But it's gorgeous, isn't it? I could even fill in embroidery uh, to colour the flowers or something like that. That was that one, and then this one I won't be able to show you all out, but it's a huge tablecloth. That, by the way, was um, that runner it was two pound for that runner. Now, they are pretty happy with that. And again, I left this on the Saturday, on the Saturday, and that's just a part of it I'm showing you there. Imagine how big this is. But again, I've got two um, blanket ottomans to cover seats in my bedroom for after decorating. Like, so I thought these could be very handy. I like these very much. Beautiful embroidery on them, and you can tell they're, you know, the vintage. They're not. Um, I don't think they like replicas or anything like that. I think they're proper vintage ones, these. So I've washed them and uh, put just a little bit of spray starch on them just to give them a little bit of crispness along there. So I'm going to have fun with them. When I was looking for bits for the bedroom and uh, for the bedroom, for the kitchen and that, um, we went to Home Base. Not home base, no, home bargains, isn't it? Home bargains. And there was these um, jars. And I'm sure they're home base. Crafted with love, yeah. I think they were, they were under three pounds. I mean, I did get two. But, I mean, they're lovely at parties if you had to put sweeties in a little cake. But I thought it would be brilliant for um, fairy houses and that. Perfect size to put uh, a little fairy in or a little fairy garden or something like that. Or anything you want. So, already on stand. So I think they're brilliant then. So very happy. And when we're at Dunham Mill, um, which is a local shop for bedding and kitchen stuff and all sorts of things. Um, I found these 
and they've been reduced actually. They were two forty nine, and I know I got them for I think one fifty or one ninety nine. But it's grass. <laughs> I'm showing you right there. Yeah, it's grass, but on a roll. Mossy grass. Where is it? Warning this out. Yeah, it's a moss roller calling it. A six by ninety seven. So it's quite a bit on and I picked up two but again I had this in mind I thought that'd be perfect for in there for the for the base of a little garden or anything like that. So especially for the English ladies if you're near Dunham Mill, a Dunham Mill, um, look out for this moss if you're into fairy gardens and what have you. This, I think it was a bargain. They say it was um, it was reduced, so I did get two two rolls of it. So that's my bargains that I found, ladies. Um, and then I've not bought magazines much, but I did buy two new parchment. This one I bought from the shop, and it's got beautiful uh, ladies there and a picture there. I, I can't even show you the card that I did for that one. It took quite a while but um, the card that I'd done, my erstwhile sister-in-law Cheryl had somebody's birthday in mind and she fancied that one so she's took that one away with her. But oh, just a little piece I've done there. This is um, but they're like dandelions. But it was a nice sentiment with that one. Uh, it's like, oh, here it is. Uh, they said, I like the sentiment with this. Mm -hmm. The seeds I sow, I sow somehow, don't grow. I'm so, oh, God. I'm sorely disenchanted. But oh, what luck I have with stuff I never even planted. So. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like my type of gardening, that. So I did like that very much. So I've cut out, I've done the the basic picture, and then I think you do that separate and then layer it up. So I'm going to be trying to do that one. But it's a, it's a nice one, this, and there's, there's a, yeah, this alphabet templates. There's usually always something free in these magazines now. And also what took me to it was, um, there's a man's there's a man's card to do with parchment. There's the ladies. I will show you some of my cards in the next little video I do um, where I've done these ladies, and they they're they're fun, they're fun to do. So I just wish for a, there's another ma, ma, a man one a man card or a man box is that a card I think. And they give nice te templates out. There's that thing again. Yeah, that's the one I had done. But, as I say, my friend liked it so much she took it away. So, I might do that one again. So, yeah, his, um, like a card one for, for a man, which I thought was quite good. Sometimes it's, it's hard. Um, I, I find I'll do any card for a man than me, but it's, I think I stuck on parchment in that one. So that was one. I so said I did get that from the shop, and I think it was. They're not cheap, these magazines, are they? Oh, well, this is for May. This was for May, it was. And I can't remember how much it was now. I can't remember ladies, sorry. But I know I got this one, it was reduced and I paid £8 for it from eBay. And again, this came with a nice die cut, free die cut of a heart and there's like, um, like, uh, what do you call it? You know, like bumblebee things there, little flowers. And I say, another one with some nice templates so, and paper, look, a bit of um, ballium, ballium, and uh, 
so it wasn't too bad that really and so this templates for boxes and you know how to do your cards and that. another one for a man with uh, that would suit me first by father-in-law because he's in he was always into planes and that especially the army type I have done that moth um, I will show you on the card that I've done I have done that moth so they're quite good magazines them and then I went out and he treated me to this one which I'm sure lots of you know but I just thought I'd let you know that it's giving away a beautiful um, stamp set for July and it's um, mermaid, mermaid wishes and starfish kisses make a splash beautiful you and there's lots of shells and fishies and of course the mermaid and then this is embossing an embossing little folder um, of waves so you can come up with some lovely cards for that I will go all the way through it um, it give you a little flick more paper which is nice always nice to have a nice catty one there we got cat friends uh, all sorts of nice little ideas as well and one there um, I'd like to try got fishes in but I don't think uh, last time I did one with fishes in it I used like a gel you know like men's hair gel I use that type of thing I don't think they're using that on there so I'm, I'm gonna have to delve into that so there we go ladies so I just thought I'd leave you with that and I'm going to come back uh, I'm going to come back and show you some cards that I've done so thank you for watching ladies and happy crafting bye for now